reacted to this before. Who's Tom McDonald? Tom McDonald? That's yeah. Alias. That's uh, Tom McDonald's the dude that wore the same clothes as Mark that wore to Vegas. What? Why? Tom why? McDonald? Why are we we're reacting to him? No, is is that that's um, the rapper guy? But yeah. That's the one that, that that Griff was like, "Yo, he's fire." Yeah, 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 yeah the yeah, weirdo yeah. with the tattoos. He's not a great rapper. He just makes like really good analysis about like where we're at in society. All right, what's up, y'all? You tuned into You Make It. We, we rate, rate it. it. Yep. Today we got a Tom McDonald diss. We were just discussing. Oh, he's oh. dissing. Oh. Oh. dissing. So the artist's <laughs> name All is right. Young Shade with a dollar sign in the S of Shade, featuring Ty Zero. Have you guys ever heard of these two artists? No. Never. Nope. No, but you know what? Let's try to get Tom McDonald to see this. Yeah, and uh, what do y'all know about Tom McDonald? Because I know nothing. Um, He's just like a, a woke white rapper. Like mm. the rest of them? Okay. No, not new school woke, like old school woke. Yeah, yeah. Before woke is he, is men. Is he good? Crazy. They call it, they call it Awaken. Yeah. Is, he, is he nice? Conscious yeah, he, rapper. He's, he's Con- a really good rapper. You think he's a really good rapper? Uh, like structure wise. I will just I'll just say really quick, Tom McDonald makes really, really good points in his music about where we're at in society, but without great lyrical ability to serve it up, in my opinion. I think he just points out that shit. No, that I goes. think he's I think he's lyrical. He doesn't like focus on s- metaphors like that, but he's pretty lyrical. All right. So um the artist said, I do not mind if the review is good, bad. Both or whatever, I don't get offended easily. Good, ha, if it ha, fucking ha. sucks, I'm gonna tell you. I have to sit through so many. So of if these. it sucks, we're gonna let you know. And um, I will be dropping his YouTube's, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, SoundCloud, Spotify, TikTok, everything in the description. It's his uh, his shit is official. Young Shade, uh, most platforms. And uh, if you want to submit and have a reaction yourself, it will be our our submission link for Fiverr will be in the description. So y'all ready to get into this? I think there is a video. Let's do it. All right. This is You Make It. We, we rate it. it. Young mm-hmm. Shade Burn Tom McDonald diss. Let's get into it. I'm excited. Who would yeah. want to diss Tom McDonald? I don't even know who he is, so fuck it. You've seen him before. I think he's very, isn't he like real conservative? Mm. I, hate any, I hate the word, the terms conservative and liberal, <laughs> liberal nah, and all he, that shit. He ain't conservative. He's white. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, mo- mo- most conservatives <laughs> are. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh, Tazi. Shit. Oh, he got the Cheetos. Oh, this better be good, bro. Burn, fuck up, burn. All that shit, dog, get you hurt. If I'm playing, try me ho. If I'm fighting, just the low. Burn, fuck up, burn. All that shit. This is Connecticut 6ix9ine. Is this a joke? Shit, dog, get you hurt. If I'm playing, try me ho. If I'm fighting, just the low. Where are they from? <laughs> Wherever they are from, Crystal Meth is easy to obtain. I think it's Boston. Nova Honey, baby, I must rap. Reaction videos of me, I must rap. Oh, Tommy, 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 Tommy. Paying for views and calling you as Tommy. I'm talking truth, but you don't want me to be heard. That's absurd. You just taught me. Gotta work on your delivery a little bit. Let's stop it right here. Um, what do did they specify if this was a parody or not? I mean, it no, has they did to not. Be. They did not. Yeah, this this can't be. What did the email say? This can't be real. What did the message say? Yeah, what did it say? He just said he doesn't care about the feedback. Here's a song. Yeah. Uh, but did he say, you know how most of them are like, I've been rapping no, a long time all since mom's medias. basement. He, he said, I don't I'm care Filipino. if they're know There's no backstory to this. This so. has to be a parody. And it's fucking almost over. What? Play, keep, fuck it, play it. If I'm fighting, drop the low, burn, fuck a burn. All that shit talk gets you hurt. If I'm playing, try me ho. If I'm fighting, drop the low, burn, fuck a burn. All that shit talk gets you hurt. If I'm playing, try me ho. If I'm fighting, drop the low, burn, fuck a burn. All that shit talk gets you hurt. If I'm playing, try me ho. If I'm fighting, drop the low. So, how are you going to come at like a lyrical rapper, which I don't mind this is of anybody? But like, <laughs> you gotta snap if you're gonna do a fucking diss. Holy fuck. Yeah, you gotta make a real diss. That's like... Yeah, respectfully, bro, like... Oh my god. For a diss, dude, you can't come across corny. And it was kind of corny, and it might be a parody, I'm not sure. And you already lost, because he didn't even diss you. He doesn't even know who the fuck you are. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait, what is this page? This has 30,000 views. Are you serious? Yeah, what do the comments say? Um, 
Y'all did that, man. Amazing. Music video looks awesome. I somehow love this. The video was it's the video props because it's funny, but in a good way. So I find that more entertaining than Tom, to be honest. So he paid for fake views and comments. I don't know. That's yeah. bullshit. It's on, yes, a, it's, on did, a page, it's on a page of 1.3 million subscribers. It's called Seven Hip Hop. And he, yeah, and he paid Wait, that's a YouTube page? Paid for placement. Yeah. Sa- save that page. <laughs> okay, that's up. Um, <laughs> well, the rest Ring of them, the bell, too. I mean, I don't have the bell. The rest of them all have um, 4.3, 2.6, 2.6, 28K, 2.2, 2.2. 2. So he 2. got- 2.2 million? Uh, no, a thousand. But he 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 has the highest view count on any video on this channel. No shot. Yeah. The next the next closest is. Well, controversy sells. Is thirty and twenty one k. Does it though? Uh, I can't even. There's your boy Avalanche the Architect. Oh, well, does please, Tom please. McDonald have like a? I don't know who that is. Does he have like a big fan? Millions. Base? He does. Yeah. Yeah. He does. Like he's... yeah. I mean, it's not surprising that this got a. Decent amount of views. No, I guess, but up Tom McDonald. I can't remember a single thing that was said in that song. No, Uh, the hook was like, I just heard some shit like Tommy, 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 and burn, baby, burn, baby, burn. If I fart, I'll take a load or something. I that's what I'm saying. This has to be a parody. They're just trying to. They're wearing wigs and Cheeto shirts. I mean, it's got to be like. Yeah, I think so. But like, I oh fuck, dude. God bless y'all if you're if you're, we're taking this serious. What'd y'all that think sucks. of the hook? Because you got burn out of it, but you know how hook's supposed to be catchy? I cannot remember anything else but burn. And everything he was saying after burn that was part of the hook, I do not know what the fuck he was saying. Yeah, I, I don't know anything that was said. If you're going to write a diss track, you got to come in hot with the lyrics and the hook. And a better beat. Honestly, the beat's not bad for a regular song, but if you're going to do a diss track, you, the, when you do a diss track, think of all the best diss tracks of all time. They have the hardest craziest fucking like face melting beats you i wrote a diss track beat. about a babysitter that's harder than that mm. damn and it really is all right so uh let's rank the lyricism in this song one through ten starting with mr kevin Sabo. zero okay cool grizz one richie b zero rachel one i'm gonna say one as well it just uh it didn't hit for all of us and uh damn. rachel are you an artist or not have you made music Ish. Anyway, so have you written ever- poetry? Where? Where? Mm-hmm. <laughs> You've written poetry? Mm-hmm. Okay, that we're, we're about to react to it next. Anyway, <laughs> so there's five artists at the table. So, guys, we this is a, the perspective of not only listeners, but people that enjoy the craft and uh, love overanalyzing it. And there is nothing to break down in this song whatsoever. Yeah. Um, what uh, you, that was really bad. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what do you guys give the beat? It's two. The beat was the hardest thing about the song. Yeah. I, I'll give the beat a, a five. <clears throat> Can you play like. Two seconds of it, so I can remember it. Now the video was well edited; it really was. Yeah, the video was cool. It was well video edited, was cool. but I don't think it was creative. two seconds of the video. I didn't like the Somebody video. paid for that. <laughs> Unbelievable. Tommy, Red Baby, Rug Red. It was like Chris Webby vibes. Four. He he. Um. Okay. He sounds like he's like asleep on something. Yeah. So let's get into. Oh, do you want to get rate the beat real quick? Did you rate it? Uh. Three. Okay. Uh, so one thing that really stood out where if you need room for improvement, I don't know if this is a parody or not, so we're just going to break it down like this is just regularly you. Um, delivery needed to be improved and cadence. Um, so what would you rate their like delivery, like their their performance with their vocals? What would you rate that? Because it's something they were very lacking in. And also give a little bit of detail and feedback on how you can improve it because like saying ones and twos is not really going to help much. You want me to start? Uh, let's start with Grizz this time. Go ahead. On the, on the whole, on the on whole cadence. No, delivery and cadence. Ugh. And how he can improve it because giving ones and twos is just going to be like, oh, one, two. Like, uh, you're great at delivery. I'm going to give it a two. Um, it's just like, it was almost off beat. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, it just wasn't, I don't even like, <laughs> it was just really bad. I'm sorry, bro. I'll just, I don't know. Yeah, I'll give it a two. How can he improve? Um, being on beat and, okay. um, Uh, Richie B. Yeah. I'd, I'd say a three just based off the fact the guy in the chorus had a good amount of energy. Yeah. Like he was he was vocal enough. He projected well, but the substance inside of it, there was just nothing there. And the people, the rap, and they were like, it was like they were on lean or something. I couldn't even like, <laughs> I couldn't even bop my head to no, it. I, I, I know, tried. It just, I tried. I, I was I just like. All right, Kev, real quick, delivery and cadence, rate it. Sorry, I just got a titty pick. Um, <laughs> <laughs> this fucking song sucks. <laughs> it um, you know what the thing about it is? Is I've I've made better parodies than that. 
Weird Al Yankovic made better par parodies than that. Like, people actually make parodies that are intended to be stupid, but the skill is in the stupid. Kevin, you can it see the picture on camera, even, by the way. Like it wasn't the titties? Even, yeah. It wasn't even funny. Well, you're welcome. Fuck. You're welcome. That's, Shouldn't that's, have sent it. You got some nudes in this, in this reaction. Anyway. It's just what? It was a parody. A parody's supposed to be funny. I didn't like that was a parody and I Kev just got a parody sent to him. <laughs> yeah, no, it, it, actually, but what, what I was going to say was the cadence, I think, was the most disturbing thing about it. Mm -hmm. I, it was just too, it was just too disruptive. And um, if they had made it to, to be constructive, if they had made it a lot more apparent, the style they were trying to parody, like remember when Hobson parodied mumble rap, but it was so apparent. Oh, it's phenomenal. What exactly was he was making fun of and made fun of it the same exact way you would need it to made, be made fun of so that you understood what the fuck was happening. Like, I, I don't know what the fuck is going on. I don't have any idea what that has to do with Tom McDonald or what it has to do with Cheetos. I, I just didn't they get They probably it. knew him growing up or something, and fucking, he just fucked them over. Yeah, so y'all just got to take your hits. I mean, I, I've gotten shit on for writing good raps, so you nah, guys, this you're not like, this sounds like if Dr. Seuss's, like, foster ch foster care ch ridden child, like, made a rap song. That's yeah. what this sounds like, because it sounded like a nursery rhyme, and it was trying to be hard in the disc, so it just didn't work. So to, not to overanalyze it, um, I definitely think there's some potential there if you keep, like, working on your craft and also not maybe rushing through what you're writing and putting some thought into it. This sounded like you memorized it in your notes app like an hour before you did yeah. it. So we are going to go through our final ranking. And let me specify. We're not going to do bump ability. Let me specify anything under a five is an L. And we have yet to have an this. L on You Make It We Rate It. So we're going to start with uh, Rachel. One mm. out of ten as a listener. How much did you enjoy this song? I'm going to give it a solid one and a half. Solely because I agree with what Richie said. I mean, the energy in the chorus was kind of there, and that's that. That's it. Okay, Red, uh, Grizz. Overall, I'll, I'll give it a two. Okay, fair. Kevin. Zero. <laughs> two to two. Richie B. No, for me, dog. It's a zero. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll be the nice guy. I'll give you a three point five. You don't mean that. Um, yeah. So. The mean is uh, two and is it half. the mean or the medium, where it's like the average ratio of the mean. The, uh, two point five. The mean is uh, is two point five, so that is a L. Um, wow, yeah, first first L on you make we rate it. But listen, um, <sighs> this is a one song reaction, and um, it was a short song. Not saying you you're not, you don't have talent. Um, you just gotta expand on your craft, and so you can definitely reach a level where like everyone has shit that they're not like when, musically that they're like ah I could have done better. Let you me know, let, let me let me say real quick not to be a complete shit talker because I always forget I'm being as mean as I am, but it's truthful because the song wasn't good. Um, if y'all were just trying to aimlessly be silly like actors, like make just a fun overall aimless parody, like fine, you know what I mean? It, uh, it, yeah, I agree. It, you know, it accomplished because the video looked you know video looked good and it, and it was fun and shit. It's the Tom McDonald connection that really lost me because yeah, you got to be ready. Don't even fucking get it. it. Sounds like haters. Yeah, I just don't get it. Yeah, the, the weird thing is, I think if in this title, if this is a parody, if you had the word parody next to the title, our rankings would have been increased by that's two that's spots. part of why I figured it was a parody also though because like it seems like a like a jokish parody thing to be like we're coming for Tom McDonald. Who the fuck's coming for Tom McDonald? You know what, <laughs> what I mean? Like nobody. All right. I don't know. So this has been You Make It. We, we rate it. it.